meteorologist Tom Atkins. Welcome to the six. Great to have you back as we look towards a very cold bayfront. Bicentennial Tower, Dias Auto and Truck Cam. A little bit of film in the bay water there. And of course, there's Perry Monument shining through the crisp cold air. Uh, 6N99 in Edinburgh, still some salt, still some snow, and uh, temperatures to 12 in Edinburgh right now. Sam Catania painting camera looking at there. So same story. Uh, the snow is actually shuffled north of Buffalo into Niagara Falls and way out over the lake. It's going to make a move back down towards our area. But again, it's going to be the places closest to the lake that are going to pick up any accumulation. For that reason, Erie Lakeshore has a winter weather advisory for tomorrow. So does uh, Chautauqua County in New York. So if you watch what's going on overnight, eventually after midnight, this band starts to come down and flirt with the lakeshore by morning. And then as you go into tomorrow, you can already see it starting to lift back up. So we'll get to that in a minute. Let's just talk temps for now. 18 and 7. So your temperatures, you know, some 14 to 17 degrees below normal. Trace of snow at Erie International Airport, only 2.4 so far this month and only 9.2 for the season. Obviously well below normal. So the cold stays with us this week. We get shots of snow, mainly on the light side. And next week, temperatures actually get above freezing. So look forward to that. What we were talking about at 530 is this thing that happens every year when you heat up your home, OK? The relative humidity around 40 4% outside at 18 degrees. Well, when you heat it up to 70, the RH drops to 6. That's what it's like in your homes. And, you know, you get dry sinuses, static electricity, cracked plaster. So here's some uh, remedies. Plants transpire moisture. Uh, vaporizers, humidifiers, of course. Even pots of standing water on just on the stove can help get that RH back up in your home. Uh, 13 in Fairview, 14 in Penn State, 15 in Venango, 12 in French Creek. I want to uh, apologize to the weather watchers that are usually use the phones. We are running a phone test, so, I, so I'm sorry I can't get to your voicemail. 14 in Cambridge, 16 in Meadville, and in Titusville. Warren at 16, and so is Youngsville. So again, what we've got going is at least light winds for tonight. Wind chills are still going to be cold, but remember, whether it's the kitties, whether it's the puppies, or whether it's the livestock or the elderly, check on them. Make sure they're warm. For tonight, cold with some late light snow, up to an inch of accumulation, 12 to 15 degrees for your low temperatures north of 90. 6 to 12, Edinburgh, Meadville, Franklin, maybe a half inch to an inch. And uh, out into the mountains, 5 to 12, Chautauqua, Warren, Forest, McKean, up to an inch. So for tomorrow, if you're close to the lake, 2 to 4 inches, Erie Lake Shore, 3 to 5 in New York State, but 1 to 2 further south. However, still very cold at 17 to 20 for your highs tomorrow. Tomorrow night, any flakes end. That's uh, 31's out of the question there for the inland. That should be a 3. It's just going to be cold for the rest of the week. Wednesday's a break day, some more shots of mainly light snow into Saturday. Then that goes away Sunday into Monday, and the temperatures finally warm up by Monday. Check out our forecast on the Your Erie To Go app. 35 is going to feel like a heat wave. It will feel much warmer than 18. Yes, it will. <laughs>